Um. Hey. I'm really glad I can get back to this. This should have been a stream two days ago, but... Um... Work has to be exhausted. And even when it didn't, yesterday I was like, Man, I'm in no mental condition to actually stream. Uh... I'm just gonna wait until Twitch Mobile gives me the notification that I can look at the dashboard. Because that's the only way I can do these things right now. Yeah, I kind of wonder if, um, oh god, I'm trying to figure out what the fuck they're called. If these, like, little teeny tiny menu cutscenes are canon. Like, is everyone just living in the van now? How far ahead in the timeline is it? Do Virgil and Dante come back every once in a while? Shit like that. Um, but we're going to be doing Bloody Palace today, or er, today. I don't give a shit. Time isn't real. Oh, oh, Twitch, Twitch, are we, be we going to play nice? Please play nice, Twitch. Please play nice. Mm. There we go. Alright, we are now 100% in order. So, for the most part, I have everyone's moveset maxed out, aside from EX Provocation. And Dante has some, uh, I think he has one Sin Devil Trigger thing I haven't bought, and I don't have the final Dr. Faust. So, whoops. Uh, we're gonna start on V. If that makes sense to me. Uh. So have you guys been? Because I've been, uh, tired. Yeah, no. <laughs> Forget match stage. Max stage reached 19. <laughs> totally. Uh, the best Devil May Cry gameplay you're ever going to see on the entire internet. Mm hmm. Um, this mode does some very interesting things with, uh, with Nero's Devil Breakers. For the most part, and I'm glad we finally have the fighting off. Gouger. All of the, uh, all of the bosses. Now, I don't know if, uh, because I know Virgil's in this. Because why wouldn't he be? He's final fucking boss. Um. But, like, I know the Goliath. And, uh, Cavalier and shit like that. Like, what the white versions of those. I'm trying to figure out are those bosses in this? Because, like, there's no real difference to him, and it wouldn't make sense for anyone to fight him, but... Also, you know, padding out Bloody Palace. So this is my favorite look of Bloody Palace by far. Come on. It's just, it's very... Clyphoth. And I like how the Clyphoth actually looks. Um, 
This is also definitely the easiest Bloody Palace in my eyes. Maybe three, actually, but I never... I don't think I ever played all the way through three's Bloody Palace. I could be wrong. But I, I don't imagine it's actually that easy. Because, like, by the time I... The last time I beat DMC3, I could give less of a shit about this mode. But then I realized, oh wait, this is where the real replay comes from. Because, like, Heaven or Hell, Hell or Hell, Son of Sparta, Dante Must Die, those modes are really cool and fun. But, uh... They aren't exactly Bloody Palace. This is also the best version of Bloody Palace in my eyes. Because it gave us a little option that you may have seen earlier on that went like, hey, warm up. Do you have a stage that you have a problem with? Fucking practice it. Because I struggle on the first boss in Bloody Palace in 4 because I like to play as not Nero in 4. He's the coolest. He's definitely the game is balanced around. I don't like playing him quite as much as I like playing Lady or Virgil or Dante, even. Yank his fucking tooth. Yeesh. Come on. <laughs> Pardon me. Oh no, he stabs through the fucking head. Alright, so we clear stage eight. Now in the stream I am going to show what I said on Twitter a couple days of this is the easiest way to get one of the harder achievements. And it's, I think, this mission, mission 10, that has the... Yeah. Alright, so you see all these enemies? So to get the quick and the dead, summon Nightmare. Let him do his thing a little bit. Just let him have some fun. Kill this one. Like nah. Nah, just let let Nightmare have some fun. So I'm starting to think that maybe just just maybe. Ah, here we go. There we go. The fuck? You guys are blue. Or white. You're like a blue purple. Not quite Discord purple, but. I envy your Either way, that's how you do it. You just let Nightmare rampage. Uh, I didn't think that it would be that difficult to get. To get five at once, but I guess Royal Fork has a range. Five extra minutes adds a multiplier. I didn't know about the uh, Red Orb Clear bonus.
you know, I'm I'm really happy with how Bloody Palace turned out. I'm I'm glad it's probably the best one. Spin. Come on, Nightmare. Thank you, Nightmare. All right. Now we just fight one of the Angelos. I think you're here, Proto Angelo. That's why I get for trying to be cool. Griffin, please. I'd rather just not have you here. It's like Griffin is really useful for uh, for evasion, but I don't I don't like him as a weapon or or an attack. I should say. I find him quite boring as uh, as something to fight with. Jesus Christ, how sharp is that cane? Actually, wait, no. That cane isn't sharp at all. You just weaken the enemies so bad that you can do things like that. Come on, neutral, neutral, neutral. Smack, 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 and dead. Because I think once we get to stage 20 is when we fight Goliath. I want to say. It's your turn. Come on, you're easier to fight in your second form. Style doesn't degradate. Degradate? Yeah, I think degradate is actually the right word. At least style doesn't go down when you, uh. When you do that finisher. See, this is what happens when you don't publicly speak for long periods of time. What an eyesore. You just. You just kind of forget how to. Whoops. Huh. Oh, God. So I think V has one of the better uh, finishers on. Oh god, are these the, uh... What the fuck are these guys called? I remember they're my favorite in... They're my favorite enemy in one. Just because I think they're creepy. Yeah. The, that finish was just fucking mean. Don't 
throw your fucking eyes at me. But here's the execution. He stabs the eye, walks away. Fuck you! Just. That feels really mean spirited. And I love it. Alright. Howdy, Fury. I remember you. You're one of the cooler enemies to fight. Woo. Howdy. Seriously? I was trying to do fucking neutrals with, uh, with Shadow, but I guess he doesn't do neutrals. There's some neutral attacks. I also think I, uh... Sorry. Sorry about this. I think I just did something wrong. Oh, no. These were, these were my specs earlier. Okay. So, I could have sworn I turned up the volume on accident. Or because I thought, oh... I'll never play DMC5 on stream again. I can do full volume now. Because the virtue of being kind of a quiet person, at least when you're on mic, because you don't want to peek it. Because I... I have no way to tell if this mic is too quiet or too loud. And that's why in my earlier streams, I'm like, hey, can you guys even hear me? And that's why I have to be like, hey, wait, no, I'm mumbling. It's it's stupid, it's weird, but it happens. Yeah, Alright, here's Goliath. So, this boss is definitely uh, centered around... Like there, there are there are bosses in this game that are definitely meant to be fought with certain characters, but it's not the problem of four where everyone is centered around one character. No, it's Dante, V, and Nero all have their own unique bosses, but there are still ways you can fight as any of the other boys. Shit. Actually, are any of the Arisen forms, uh, are those available as fights? I envy your optimism. It's not as bad as the last time I fought. <laughs> so I've not gotten past Goliath on anyone. And I'm not trying to set personal records to none. But, if we could kill Goliath, that'd be really cool. No, we need to heal. I don't know how to avoid that as V. 
do, do I just take it? Because my only other thought is IDT. But I, I can't. I also don't know if that, uh, if that rumored Bloody Palace co-op is possible. I would really like it to be. I think actual proper DMC co-op would be really cool. Damn it! Yeah, see, I got... V is the only character that I can consistently get Goliath really low on. Not, not Nero, though. <laughs> no. I don't know what it is about playing as V that makes Goliath so simple to fight. And it could be that um, there's there's speculation that I think there was a trailer where V actually fights Goliath. And correct me if I'm wrong on that one, because I don't actually remember the trailers all that much. But I do remember the... Um, Oh, what is it? Just like, all around people talking about like, wait a minute. Fucking V is, uh... V is fighting Goliath. And I never bothered to check. But people are like, oh, maybe this was his boss originally. And some people on Twitter are like, no, it's Bloody Palace. And I'm like... Bloody Palace wasn't finished on release, I thought. Just assume it wasn't. So now we're going to play Nero. I know my exceed timing's a little better. Um, I know I can do some cool shit with DT. So this is the cool answer to, like, oh, how are we going to handle Devil Breakers? This is how. So we grab Kibera. We're gonna grab Ragtime. Rawhide's always fun to play with. I'm starting to like Tomboy a lot. Let's snag Helter Skelter. Let's throw a punchline in there. Rawhide. Gerbera. Did I start calling it Gerbera again? What the fuck? Alright. Ow. That, that's not a good start. Oh well. End of the day, I don't care. We're good. We're alive. Yeah, 
Yeah, no. Um. So they give the Buster arm in this uh, in that little selection there. But like, I don't see. I don't see a use for Buster once you hit New Game Plus. And I think I actually mentioned that in the LP of, like, I have no clue how this item will work outside of your first playthrough. Apparently I saved 36 seconds on that. That's sick. So DT is kind of useful. <laughs> and I, I'm really glad that I can just use it in normal play now, because it is the handiest thing to kick in. Because, like, it also, like, I don't want to say it negates a pre-order item, because those don't really exist to be... Those don't exist to be used in normal play by a normal player. But, like, Devil Trigger feels like it invalidates Sweet Surrender a little bit. Because, like, the other ones are fun, like the Pasta Breaker. And the, um... The Pasta Breaker and the Mega Buster... They kind of have uses, I think. Still haven't bought the uh, deluxe edition upgrade, because I just... I'm going to wait. So let's start using Rawhide. Because, like, Nero al Nero's already got an error page. am I doing that's keeping a constant S rank or constant triple S Oh, but wait. Oh, did I accidentally smash? Oh. I think next stage is the fucking... Uh, yeah, alright, the rest area. Oh, the rest area doesn't count as a stage. Nor should it, but... Alright, let's snag ragtime. Thing, punchline, rawhide. Let's play with overture. 
Never go wrong with Tomboy. And then Gabara. Or Gerbera. See, that's like months of like mental programming. To to get over. Um, I'm actually gonna take a quick, um, I'm gonna take a quick break because I forgot to do something. Uh, I just forgot to do a thing or two. It shouldn't take more than a couple seconds to actually throw the word out on this. That's not what I meant to do. I'm bad at this, ain't I? Ugh. You know, it does... So, like, additional thing that's a bit fucky. I actually don't know if there's any way... to, like... I can get my URL, and my URL is fine. But, oh, share link to channel. There we go. There. Alright. So, hey, Twitch, if you're listening, your stream message that's like, hey, I'm streaming at blah. It doesn't work on Discord Mobile. That's a bit of a problem. Like, I had to... F 
I'm like, what the fuck is wrong with the stream message? It worked on Twitter. Oh! Oh! Tw fucking Discord Mobile wants me to put the fucking HTTPS colon forward slash forward slash... Ugh. Oh, that's just sad. That just sucks. Okay. I'm sorry about that. That was very unprofessional. But this is what happens when you forget. Um. Damn it. Oh, does he actually have, like, a little fake out? Come on. Get him in the suplex. Yup. Do a taunt. Put me off to badass. That was just bad. That wasn't great. Two tomboys in a row probably wasn't the best idea. Boom. Hit you with overture. Come on. Be a good sport. Fuck you. I didn't know about that. Okay. Each day we learn a bit more. Say, let me kill you before you do that so I can get some free red orbs. Mm. Yeah, because once I save up for Dr. Faust level 4, I can then start saving up for EX Provocation, which, should I stream this again for funsies? Oh! Oh, is that a crunch? Yeah, it was. Oh, they still laugh. Okay. But now, given the story for DMC5, these guys coming back is not a surprise. You know what? Sometimes you just forget you have a gun. Sometimes.
doing all right. If the, this is the guy that you want. Come on. Come on, I just want a break, Rhea. Damn, you just can't be breakered. It's my only conclusion. I can't suck. No. No, it's never the fault of the player. Total. No, I know that you you like to run away. this Goliath? Yeah, that loading screen's enough to be Goliath. So this is where the actual fun part is. I'm gonna have to sacrifice at least one. Because, like, Ragtime, I'm pretty sure Ragtime is useless on bosses. Alright, Nero's air taunt gives enough air time to be a dodge, but also for a stall. got me a bit more air time. Fuck you. There's nowhere actually fun to throw him. Oh, 
Okay. I see what happened here. And I'm not happy. Because, like, alright, if you're thrown into that, you're supposed to do a breakaway. But you can't do that. You, you can't do that too early. And I broke Gerbera way too early. And we're gonna give Dante a shot. You know what, fuck it. I've never actually played with this costume. And other people seem to like it, but I just think he looks like Spencer from iCarly. Now I have done some alteration to his moveset. Shouldn't be too much of an issue. Mo mostly I just like Rebellion, so I kept it... I kept it on hand. I, I like Rebellion's... Uh, Swordmaster moves a lot more than I like Sparta and Demon Sword Dante. Okay, so I may have just been exceeding. I I may have just exceeded, just so I could. Uh... Ooh, that's embarrassing. God damn it. Yeah. I do like this look. Actually, the the Dino skin with the uh with the gay cowboy hat. Hell yeah. This summer, Dante is a gay cowboy. God damn it. Forgot you gotta be up in the air a little bit to actually do the... Or you don't. Was I doing it neutral? Yeah, I was just doing it neutral. Never mind. Alright, so I'm halfway. Well, I mean, I'll take the all zeros. It's better than being in the negatives. What the fuck is the windup? Is get more orbs actually making it so that I'm not losing out? Kinda? Okay. Come here. And now... 
All right, there. Can you get you? Gonna say that's gonna be the impuses in their queen. actually been able to figure out what triggers Sin Devil Trigger. Not consistently anyways. attack. Negative 35 seconds. Fuck yourself. Bing bada boom, we all good. You know, I 
I wish through Balrog Dante had some sort of grapple. Because, like, it feels like it would be the perfect weapon to have, like, a command grab. Like, again, that's probably something they want to have for Nero. What did I just hear him say? Um, but no, I, I feel like Balrog would have been a great opportunity to give Dante a command grab. Granted, I don't know what goes into balancing Dante aside from D DMC Devil May Cry doing it very poorly. No, you will not put the hat on me. I think I will. You go on like We have one beer. Hello, welcome. Just some, uh... Me figuring out how the Proto Angelo actually works. I never got an opportunity. There we go. So I'm just gonna pop DT throughout this next fight. Cause like, I don't like how my health is looking. Trickster is just neutral for me. See, it's all good. It's all good. You? Ah, you're just gonna be a pain in the ass. God damn it, I actually I accidentally switched to Royal Guard, and for once I didn't mean it.
Oh, shit. All right, yeah, I was going to say, that's definitely a new record for me. Let me just stretch. Well, because my shoulders are just fucking tense. Wow. Trickster? Got an S rank on that. All right, I'll fucking take it. Come on, Goliath, just load in. Come on. Give me that sweet, sweet scent. Right up your ass. All right. You know what? You got that one. Is that a perfect? Fuck off. Yeah, see, I don't... That attack is weird for anyone that doesn't have breakers. I don't understand how you're supposed to actually get out of it. Aside from maybe a DT. It's gotta be double trigger, right? Can't be anything else. Either way, um, I'm just gonna do the one rotation. 
I decided, like, eh, I've got a limited amount of time, might as well do a short Bloody Palace stream. Um, so, thank you for coming. If you've made it this far, I don't know why you would have. I am so sorry that I'm not used to... I'm sorry that I've started shutting up. For the most part. Um, because, like, after a couple days of being sick, you kind of forget how to do commentary if you were only just then starting to get used to it. So... <laughs> Um, I hope everyone has a good night, has a good day, um, I will eventually be back with some more, uh, it's either gonna be Bloodborne or Resident Evil 7, I'm not gonna play much else until the rotation's finished, so, uh, I'll hopefully see you guys there again, thank you for coming. And have a good night.